how to find the net force. So far, okay, in our syllabus, eh, there are two types of questions. One is the questions that involve uh, linear motions. Eh? Means the object is in a uh, linear motion, means the motion in a straight line, okay? And then uh, the force uh, is either same directions or opposite directions, okay? But uh, after this, uh, we are going to learn forces which is not the same or opposite directions, okay? Uh, for example, so if the force acts here and here, then uh, how to find the net force? That, that, that are the different discussions, okay? Yep. So far, we just discussed the uh, forces which are in the same directions or opposite directions only, yeah? Okay? Uh, let's start with this one. Okay, now let me show you the notes uh, of this. Uh, okay, it's this one. Uh, a, B, C, D, E. Okay, we are discussing this one. Okay, so uh, this is A, this is B, C, D, and E. Uh, okay, now for A, uh, for A, there's only one force act on this object, uh, so therefore the net force F equals to 20 Newton. That's all, okay? For B, there are two forces act on this object, um, 20 Newton to the right and uh, 5 Newton to the left, okay? So therefore the net force, uh, the net force um, F equal to 20 minus 5, uh, which is equal to 15 Newtons uh, to the right, okay? To the right. Uh. Mm. Force is a vector, so you need to tell the directions, okay? Uh, C. So can any of you tell me what's the net force? C. Just tell me the magnitude, okay? Don't need to tell the direction. Just tell me the magnitude. C, 5 Newton. Eh? 5 Newtons to the left. Okay. D. D. F equal to what? 15 Newtons. Yes, to the right, right? 15 Newton to the right. Uh, e, the last one. Ten Newton to the left. Okay. Yeah. Twenty five plus fifteen forty. Yeah, forty Newtons. So to the left, forty Newtons. To the right, thirty Newtons. Huh? So therefore, the net force is uh, ten Newton to the left. So that is how we find the net force.